Hello everyone, Father James here. Just gonna give you a little bit of information for this coming Sunday. We're really excited uh, that we're gonna be able to have mass outside. I hope everybody was hanging their rosary beads out because it looks like it's gonna be a great day. So mass is gonna be Sunday at 8 a.m. Um, and we're gonna ask everybody to park in the parking lot over in front of the church. And you can park on the streets going down around the church and the school and where you can find a spot. We're gonna ask that when you get out of your car that you have your masks ready, um, any hand sanitizer that you're gonna have, and then you can come over this way. There's going to be, um, there'll be ambassadors or ushers with hand sanitizer, parishioners who will be directing you. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna come right around here. The lot is gonna be marked off. You can see that we have rope around the trees and around the trees on Hearst. And what we're gonna ask people is to come in through this way, the corner of Hearst and Collins. And there's gonna be ushers to direct you. There's gonna be a table set up right here. And on that table is going to be hand sanitizer as you come in and a couple of baskets. One of the baskets will be for the little index card that you're gonna fill your name out on and your number. And the reason we're doing that is if, God forbid that there is an outbreak that happens in the parish, if you would like to be contacted by our parish, notified that that happened, we'll be able to give you a call and notify you. It's not mandated, but if you'd like that service, you want to call it a service, uh, we'll, we'll have that option. There'll also be another basket um, so that you can put your envelope in or donation uh, for the weekend for the parish. And then an usher is going to take you from here and they're going to bring you to a spot where you're able to sit. So we're asking everybody to bring their lawn chairs, um, masks, and whatever kind of hand sanitizer, anything like that uh, that you're gonna bring. So they're gonna bring you right over. And the altar is going to be set up right in front of the fence with the ambo. And there'll be microphones so that we can hear. And then if you, if Joseph can uh, pan down, you'll see on the grass there are X's everywhere. There's X's all over the field. So an usher will bring you, if you're a single person, we have a space over on that side for singles. If you're a couple, we have a space for there. And then this section over here is going to be for uh, parties of, feels like we're at a restaurant, uh, parties of three or more. So if you're a big family, say like five or six, you get two X's. But the ushers will show you. You won't have to worry about a thing. Um, the ushers will, will direct us and show us where to go. And then mass will go on. There will be no singing because it's we're directed not to sing, but uh, we'll have instrumental music. We'll be directing you and telling you what, what's going to happen, how communion will go on. So communion will be a little bit different. We will be um, distributing the body of Christ, but we will not be distributing the blood of Christ. And what's going to happen is Father Kyle's going to take a section, I'm going to take a section, Deacon Frank's going to take a section, and we will come to you uh, for communion. So we will go in between the rows uh, giving out communion, and, and we will direct you. But what we're going to ask is um, that when it comes time for communion, that you lay your hand flat so that we can place the host in your hand and drop. Priests and deacons will be wearing masks for the distribution of communion. And then when we come to you, we'll be explaining to you either you pull your mask up to receive or pull over and receive. Uh, so those are some of the little things. It's looking to be a beautiful day. Um, we'll do all the thinking for you. Just come, pray, relax, feel safe. Don't worry, but it's going to be wonderful to see all of you. We've missed you uh, and we're praying for a great day. Have a wonderful day. God bless.